dressed in blue overalls with brooms and the book to be launched, the activists dared the police who had sealed off the entire constitutional square. We are going to clean up. No, 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 no. My, my brother, don't, don't, push. don't, 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 Grounds the police have outlawed as a venue for any protests. A confrontation then ensued and tension began to mount as police ordered them off the area. Here it is clean already, we are clean. We are not we coming out to fight. No, no, no. For us, we have to clean. We have come, we have come to clean this place and we shall clean it. But the students dug in the hills and went about cleaning the place ahead of the launch of the book. Is it the fundamental change? that, among others, analyzes the change promised by President Yoweri Museveni when he assumed power in 1986. <laughs> However, police moved fast, rounded up two students, and whisked them away. The other students who were not arrested did not give up until police arrested two more. The president of the Forum for Democratic Change, Dr. Kiza Besije, who was the guest of honor, arrived at the scene, but there was nothing much to do. We want to find out whether they, they are going to be released to come and launch the book. He was later allowed to go and see the activists who were in police custody. Then there was drama when the Forum for Democratic Change, Iron Lady Ingrid Trinawe, was blocked from entering the police station. Don't touch me. You want to rape me. You want to rape me. What's wrong with you? I'm going to see my sister. Is this your home? She later forced her way into the police station. One of those arrested, Doreen Nyanjura, was produced before the Law Development Center Court and charged with holding unlawful assembly. Hilara Isiga, NTV. We shall overcome! We shall overcome! We shall overcome!